here is Memo Brook. This is one of our premium wines. Um, the grapes are mainly estate grown, so they're all valley uh, grapes. So you've got a nice full bodied wine. Let's pour this for you. And this is a wine that you can sell off for 10 years. Have lovely berry flavours. And it? tell us about um, Memo Brook and what that means. Right, now the name Memo Brook. Uh, comes from Genesis in the Bible. It means something like homeland. When uh, William Salter first came out here, he named his house Memory Brook House because this was now going to be his home. So that's where that name originated from. And they've chosen one of their premium wines to um, carry that name. So we can remember that. And we've got another wine to try. Is that the, the number yes, one? we'll try number one. Yeah. So this wine has a story as well. Uh, so William Salter was a farmer to start with and he went into uh, winemaking in 1859 it was, put his first vines in, he produced his first wine in 1861 and he called it number one. And we still have a number one, um, of course it's from different vines to what he planted back then, but this is uh, one of our flagship vines, beautiful premium red, lovely berry flavours uh, and once again you can sell this for 10 plus years. Beautiful. Just try that one for you. Grapes for this come from different vineyards in the valley. It depends on the year, what vineyards they take them from, but they're always premium grapes. There's um, always premium grapes in Barossa, though, isn't it? Oh, so. Barossa does have premium grapes. <laughs> and we're in that. So not only is Salt Wine Estate one of the oldest wine properties in the Barossa, it also has a restaurant open seven days a week, a tasting bar and Sunday sessions. And of course, Mammarook House, just across the way, is the original homestead of the Salt family.